Black lives matter. Don't do that to her. Don't do that to her. Her black lives matter. No, no, stop. Don't fight her. No. You being recorded. Don't do that to her. No. Give her her stuff, y'all. Don't do that to her. That ain't right. She paid for that. I got you on camera, though. That's fucked up. Why y'all doing her like that? Uh-uh. Let her out. Come out, sis. Come on. You can make it. Oh, nah, she stuck. Damn. They got you, sis. Give me your, give me your mom number. What's her number? You want me to call somebody? Don't do that to her ankle. Her ankle going to break. Her ankle is going to break. They breaking her ankle. Oh, my God. He kicking her. That's fucked up. Her toe fucking broke. Oh shit, he, he done scuffed her shit up. Her pool was scuffed up, that's fucked up. Sis, you, sis, sis, I told you. I got her on video, I got you, sis. Bitch, call Johnny Cochran. They jumping her. Oh shit. That's fucked up. Sis, I got you. I got you, sis. I got you. Let her out. Just let her out. I'll pay for it. How much she owe? How much she owe? I'm, I'm going to pay for it. I'm going to pay for her shit. Let her out. Damn, she had a whole cart full of shit. Sis, they, let her out. I'm going to pay for it. Oh, he's slamming her shit. Damn. Let her ankle live. Let her ankle live. That's messed up. Yo, they got her. She gone. I tried. Fuck. It's a wrap. Hello, everybody. Just another day that the Lord has made, boy. Blessings for everyone. You see that intro? Y-A-R. Happy New Year. <laughs> there. You already know what I'm on. Florida teacher told students that black people are beneath white people to justify using the N-word. Beecham's son asked his teacher how she would feel if someone called her a cracker, and she responded by calling him a N-word and saying, you don't have the privilege to call white people crackers because black people are beneath white people. But before I begin any of the ranting and raving that I do oh so well, let me show you what I'm working with. Homemade meatloaf, cabbage, potatoes, carrots. Look at that. I've told y'all before in our family, everyone gets their own individual meatloaf. Look at that. Ah, drinking, uh, drinking grape juice. Let's go ahead and say our grace. Let's get it on in. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this food we're about to receive. May it nourish our bodies and strengthen our minds. In your name we both pray, amen. I got my number one here. My nephew, DJ. Hey, DJ. He's at work. Slave. Get out. Get out. Get out. Yo, stop. Get out. Get out. What are you guys doing? Get out. What are you guys doing? Get out. What's wrong with you? Don't touch me. Don't you have to. Do not touch me. Get out. Get out. Do not touch me. Get out. I'm not touching you. Oh, did you just hit me? Did you just hit me? You just hit me. You just hit me. You too? Black lives matter. Yo, this is great. Wow. Black lives matter. Black lives matter. Black lives matter. Yo, stop. Yo, stop. Stop recording me. I don't know you. Yo, you need to stop. Get out. I'm not getting out. I was here Yes, you are. Now, I'm not going to lie. Some of this racism, prejudice, is right on the verge of the makings of a good-ass horror flick. What are, you, what are you videotaping for? The cops aren't gonna do shit. This should go right around your neck, you little nigger. Morning by morning, no mercy, I
something behind me? Fox is watching you. There's, a, there's an actual video camera right there. And it's piping right into Fox. <laughs> You'll get some therapy for God. I mean, this is America. If you're racist, that's your business. Inward this and inward that, but a Caucasian can't. So say it. Say what? Say the word you want to say. I'm not saying that I want to say it. I'm just saying that I can't. Sure you can. Say it. Say it right now. <sighs> I will say it with you. Okay. This is hypocritical. You know we can't. Sure you can. This is America. Both of you. Say it. <laughs> mm, I... Mm. All right, I think we can move on. Why? Why move on when you want to say it? Both of you want to say it. Huh? All together, everybody. Just don't bring that shit outside. Come right hey, here, buddy. Up. Right here. Tell me what you were doing. Cindy, Burning out racing through my fucking neighborhood. Burning out Come racing on, through my I fucking neighborhood. I told you not to. Get out of my face. I'm not in your Get face. face. Get out of my neighborhood, fuckwad. Who got a gun? Who got the gun? The guy who's got a permit to carry it. You got a gun? You're the one that would get All right. a gun. All right. All right, get out of this neighborhood. All right. Get out of this neighborhood. You don't belong here, brother. What y'all want to smash the fucking window? Smash the window? Yeah, he did. Calm down, now get back to your seat. I'll take care of this. Calm down. Calm down. Get a hold of yourself. Don't do your one on the phone. Everything's gonna be all right. Please. Sister, please don't handle this. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. Don't bring that shit to my job. And by all means, have the decency to protest in silence. They're just yelling at black folks, basically. They don't, and these they're, are white people yelling back at <laughs> They're mad because this is a black business. Yeah, they mad it's a black business in Athens. That's ridiculous. You got you. They're saying that Pinky is the leader of Black Lives Matter. Listen, you deliver in the fucking packages. 
respect the fucking slow sign or don't fucking come in my driveway. Don't, don't scream at me. Don't I'll fucking scream at y'all the fuck you want. Don't scream at me. All your fucking truck fucking ripping. Don't scream at me. I'll do whatever the fuck I want. No, you you're don't. on my property, motherfucker. If you don't want to listen to me, you? get the fuck out of here. Do you know your package? I don't give a fuck. All right. Have a good day. Have a good day. He said he doesn't want it. Hey, I'm still here, man. What are you gonna do about it? I'm the you know, I'm leaving. I'm leaving, okay? Have a good day. There are people traveling on business or maybe to go see families. Keep that racist homophobe to yourself. Está macheteando mi vitrina. Ajá. Estoy grabando. Yo, calm down. You good, bro? What's that old saying? You are what you eat. I need some of us. And I'm not trying to be funny. I am dead serious with this, okay? We went to Mexico for a week. Since we came back from Mexico, my armpits smell like a Mexican. Every time I sweat, it is dirty Mexican coming out from my every orifice. I am not shitting y'all. I am dead serious. I have changed deodorants. I have tried everything. It smells like tacos under my arms, like I'm a walking enchilada. And I need to know if there's anything that I can do to help figure out this problem because I smell like it right now a dirty Mexican like I smell like I worked a 12 hour shift at the Don Juan's and came on down here trying some clothes so if y'all got any solution all y'all old silver valians if y'all got anything Donna Manus I'm talking to you if you got anything that you think will work like I'm scrubbing I done changed yet I don't know I've sprayed I've done everything dirty Mexican okay number six here we go I mean if you raise this you raise it Stop hiding your racism in the shadows. 
I have a copy of her extremely racist 911 call, and I'm going to go ahead and play it, because Dr. Nar deserves to have this nonsense attached to her name. Howard County Communications, the sign's being recorded. How can I help you? My name is Stephanie Nar. Indian neighbors don't do this. My white neighbors don't do this. The only people that act like this are fucking black people. They're the only people that are assholes that act like this in the United States of America. Okay? They are the people that cause ruckus, that cause noise, and that are assholes. And I want the music to stop, and I want to go to bed. Back up. They're fucking assholes, and they don't care about their neighbors. And that's why I don't want to live next to them, actually. Because, like I said, my white neighbors, my Indian neighbors, my Asian neighbors, none of them fucking act like this. What is the truth? You know... You know all this starts in the home. Teach your children that racism and bullying will not be tolerated. It's not acceptable. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Get the fuck out. No. Get the fuck out. No. Hold on. I get the angle right. Hold on. Oh, I'm not getting off. Literally, nobody's sitting here. 4K also HD, get this one. 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 Get Please watch who you do business with. Fucking okay, nigger boyfriend, dude. Uh, yeah, you, and you're a nigger too. Uh, Shit. That's how you are? And you been around my fucking niece and nephew? He needs to calm the fuck down. Do not even fucking think about it. If you touch a If you, if I, you touch no, don't, don't even do that. You will be. Don't even do that. Do that, you you do that to me, I promise you. Do that to me, I promise you. Do that to me, I promise you. Pregnant with your little nigger baby. Oh, really? Yes, really. Who you watch and support on TV? Joy Bayer on The View needs to sit down. Like, get this woman off air. Watch this. Okay. Here's the thing. Once black people get guns in this country, the gun laws will change. Trust me. And who are all these Karens clapping for that? Once black people get guns in this country, the gun laws will change? See, this is the kind of racism that these Biden voters don't even realize that they have. Who you vote for? Apologize for what? They're not a racist bone in my body. The three congressmen you have here, two of them look like they could, they really could and did play ball, and the other one looks like he'd bomb you. And who supports the ones that people vote for? Nazi. Do I embrace it? Um, I, I don't try to push it away. Well, you're wearing a swastika on your shirt. Exactly. And you've got swastika flags. And rural America spoke up when they elected Trump. Rural America. And by rural America, he means white America. We're staring down the barrel of a gun here in white America. There's still 193 million white Americans. Yes, the vast majority of them are in their 60s and 70s, will be in the ground in the next 20 years, and therefore we have the possibility of becoming a minority in our own country. A possibility. It sounds to me. Of becoming a minority in our like own country. Like you're afraid of being me. And being me. This is my country. Is great. This, it, this is also my country. You guys didn't win the culture war. He invited us on his property to talk, but when he doesn't like our conversation, he explodes. Get the f out of here! F now! <laughs> Call me a skeptic. But I still believe in the judicial system. The one right here with the glasses, grown man with kids throwing the rocks up with guys. Um, this, is, this is my car, right? This is what they throw into my son's car. A big old stone while he was in the car. So you guys know that. They're trying to say nobody was in the car. Um, they, they're trying to go with the guys word against my son's word so i'm just going to do this video right here just in case something happened to me um, um 
but we, you know, we're gonna go to the fullest with that. They mess with the wrong person. Even though it can be a slow process. Remember this woman, Lorraine May Lake. She made racist threats to her neighbors for months now. The district attorney's office put this out today, stating that Lorraine May Lake has been charged with six felony counts of criminal threats, one felony count of violation of civil rights, as well as hate crime allegations, two misdemeanors, one for possession of firearms while having a restraining order, and another one violation of civil rights. And two more misdemeanors for resisting arrest and violating court orders. Now these consequences are what we wanted to see. I'm just saying, leave the kids out of it. guys like what you've seen here like comment and subscribe and i'll talk to you guys and you guys soon